Okay, I need to finish the recording. These are the walnuts my mother confessed yesterday that my niece have purchased these walnuts. What I can tell you about these walnuts is this walnut made me so sick uh, that it was bad. Um, what I can tell you about this walnut, why I'm video recording this stuff, is the looks. For me, this is a real, real treat. These are the best walnuts in the world right now because they're poisonous. Question here is to what degree they are poisonous. They are poisonous exactly to degree, yes? Uh, my niece is an uh, inspector, food inspector. They are poisoned exactly to degree. My niece decided that would cause me heavy damage, heavy harm, but would not cause any kind of harm to my mother because uh, they played with uh, to what degree certain food has a poisonous effect on me during MK Ultra, and to what degree certain food uh, does not have poisonous effect on mother. And it was my niece who explained to me that she will buy the kind of walnut that will have a poisonous effect on me, but not on mother. She explained to me, she said, sorry, she said, sorry. So today I'm going to say, sorry, she's going to have a police on her neck because of this kind of stuff. So she purchased, according to her instructions, exactly the type of walnut that would kill me eventually. This is about cancer. Absolutely, this is about cancer. Type of walnut that would kill me, but would not cause damage to my mother, whom they also tested. They tested. That means we have a double system inside of the house. We have the type of system that they made me so sick with the cancer that something that can easily kill me would not do any kind of damage to mother. So mom can eat something, and mom knows exactly what, because she was trained by the police, by the psychiatrist. They evaluated all the food, all the products. And she can eat stuff that will actually kill me. And this is a perfect example. And I really want to thank my niece. My mother have hidden this inside of the store when I pull it out. Um, she have hidden this inside, inside, of, the, inside of her room. Uh, lock the door and so on and I'm not gonna eat it I just want to video record there is nothing there is no no name anywhere there is nothing on it there is nothing absolutely nothing on it this walnuts they purchased this kind of walnut like this they are so fucking poisonous when I ate them that the only thing that happened was my lymph nodes my gland nodes Lymphoma cancer, it just fucking exploded. The sound exploded. That's lymphoma cancer. So that is why I took this and video recorded. Not so that I would eat, but I just want to video record. I don't know what is it with this walnut here. Let's see this here. If you can note something, irregular, whatever. It, look, it looks uh, very nice. Uh, my niece studied all the walnut. Uh, but uh, they look kind of dark. They do look kind of dark. I don't see that the walnut would have any kind of... Um, anything on them, you know. I don't see any kind of uh, mold or anything like this. Uh, and or there is a possibility that you know it's a different kind of mold. Uh, this was one of the subjects that was involved in MK Ultra, and they came to conclusion that is super, super, super deadly. 
And it's, it's interesting to note that psychiatrist Peter Kapsch and our Mesto police investigators were gathering the walnuts from entire Slovenia to test what kind of walnut it would be used. And it was my niece that was extremely, extremely fascinated with this product here. Because again, it's like sort of impossible to prove. So my niece became investigator and she played the psychiatrist literally with the poisoning, using a poisonous product, uh, literally through advisory of police per what kind of liability she would carry for the products she alone would involved in MK Ultra. Sorry, but I'm going to say to my niece, sorry, sorry. I'm going to say to you, sorry. And I'm also going to say to you, thank you. You know what's coming next to you. So this exactly this kind of walnut. She will explain all these issues, how this kind of stuff. What this kind of stuff uh, did to me is indescribable. You get to hear sound 24-7. And you get the pain in your lymph nodes. You're a step closer to death. That's all there is. I was catching like this for the finger to avoid one throughout this process. Especially because they involved destruction of the private property, vandalizing of the computer, hard drive and such issues. I had to carry everything with me. And it's impossible to describe walking with a backpack that weighs, I don't know, well over five kilos. What kind of damage this does to your lymphic system? The police was literally enforcing extermination procedure and did so since 2017. And then you can imagine what next parallel to the stuff that when that they developed through the poisoning during MK Ultra. I had to deal with in real time. It's amazing. I'm extremely, extremely pleased to be alive. And yesterday, because I suspended this kind of walking, I don't do the walking anymore. I do the exercise indoors, but I don't do any kind of walking like this, like I used to. Uh, I have recuperated myself so well when it comes to lymph nodes uh, that... Uh, I actually have a fair, really, chances to survive this shit. But this is the stuff that hunts you indoors, this kind of stuff, this. There's no, there's no nothing. Uh, I think she got this kind of walnut from another region of Slovenia, not from Novo Mesto, but that she got this from uh, Škocijan, actually from Brežice, something like this, even Štajerska region, something like that, or whatever region. So they're playing deliberately. So thanks to this kind of walnut that they believe that I'm going to go and sneak and eat, uh, I learned a lot of stuff about how this stuff was done inside of the house. Yeah, this is going to the internet right now.